I just sprayed them with my scorpion brew. <clears throat> we both might be choking <clears throat> to death. <clears throat> Give it another spray. Right to the face. I want to leave and come back. A couple I burnt to death. I'm on my third one. Should be in the middle of the frame there. The little bastard I took out. He's like burnt to death right there on the leaf. I still want to get him out. But, but what I do is spray. Then I wait till the worm releases a little bit. And then I go to town inside, like right in the face, in the mouth, in the body, like I did on this one. Yeah, so with that one, you can see he's hanging with his body um, outside because he was crawling down the middle of the leaf like they normally do. And so I sprayed him, wait till he released a little bit, then went to town on the inside. So. I think he's now dead just as this one is hasn't moved he started crawling down but because he's in the middle of the head near the head there it... see what i mean this one is still hanging off the edge of that but this one i had to come back and spray him again look at him trying to go around the side of that leaf am i getting him i don't know if i'm getting him or not but anyway that's my thing that's my point sometimes they don't die even once you've sprayed them and this is 20 minutes later he just had to he just had to get his his get his uh bearings together so he could regroup just know that he's not going to last through this next round that guy, I'm pretty sure, is gone. And this guy appears to finally be gone. Because he's not moving anymore and his head is in that... I don't know, I thought this other one was dead. And look at him. He's frozen in that place now. It's like he was frozen on his back. He's not going to make it through this one, y'all. I won't film this revolution will not be televised but there's about to be an uprising a mutiny sir against the cabbage moth i had to stand this middle plant back up but everything looks like it appreciated the natural rain of course you see all these yellow flowers I have my bee, uh, my bumblebee that is working hard on getting uh, all the possible flowers uh, to give me some fruit. I literally have one individual bee that's doing all this work. So shout out to that bee who is around here somewhere. I know you're doing all that work by yourself. One of my watermelon. I'll wait. My flowers are starting to bloom on the okra. Curly kale doing well. Uh, my spider just climbed back up to the light. But I have a spider that has a web here that is apparently keeping, uh, th either keeping things off the kale or eating them once they land. I don't know. Either way, thank you. Shout out to this spider here for taking care of my kale. And the purple basil looks gorgeous. Um, I want it to seed. So this I'm trying to get out to seed, but the flowers keep blooming and closing up and blooming and closing up. 
so I'm not really sure what yeah, Dinosaur Kale really appreciated the storm. My lettuce, my fall crop lettuce that I just planted. College here. Oh, really? Found me a worm, y'all. He has to die. Tomatoes, lemon, Honeycrisp, Meyer lemon, Honeycrisp apple, chocolate mint and regular peppermint, herbs of red ruben basil, sage, cilantro, and oregano, onion. So I hope these are still making seeds in there. Anywho, let me go kill this uh, worm. <laughs> 